It used to be a case of more cylinders the better, but here are two examples of the most popular sports cars in the country at the moment, and guess what? They're both four cylinder. So has the world gone crazy with its desire to downsize? Let's find out. We're about to pin it in the Mustang, see how we go. A little bit slow up the bottom. I'll tell you what, it gets going at about four and a half, five though. Quite impressive. I think a few people would be definitely be surprised at that. So one thing I rate about the four cylinder engine is it's lightweight. It doesn't have a big, massive V8 over that front bonnet and it really helps that turn in response. The Mustang really does pour on the speed. It really does get going quite high in that RPM rev range. And it's not slow. 0 to 100 in under 6.4 seconds. So this four cylinder Mustang has really surprised me. The performance is fantastic. But one area where it really lacks is the noise. It sounds like a video game or a broken washing machine. It really is synthesized in terms of its noise and it just doesn't suit this car. Whereas the Focus, however, that thing sounds amazing. So same test in the Focus. Let's just nail it. See what we got. Well, that's quite responsive. That really does pin you back. As you'd expect, it's got a little bit more power. So as far as four cylinder engines go, this doesn't sound like one. This sounds raucous and beefy. Focus doesn't feel like a four cylinder, it doesn't sound like a four cylinder. It really is meaty. It gets going from quite low down to the RPM rev range. It really does get on with it. And the sound, how good is that? So ticking away at 1500 RPM on the freeway, give it a bootful and overtaking is no sweat. So these four cylinders can do everything a V8 car can do. I'm not sure how well they'd go towing a boat with a trailer though. So I've taken these two rockets for a bit of a skid. This one's fast, this one's faster. It's got a little bit more power. The dimension they both share the same EcoBoost 2.3 litre turbocharged four cylinder engine. What's EcoBoost? Basically marketing jargon for downsized turbocharged engine. But that doesn't mean these cars are any less fun than a big V8. And on the flip side, the bonus hip pocket savings when you go and fill up. Well, downsizing's here to stay, but it's not all doom and gloom for us petrol heads cars are just simply not going backwards in performance as these two prove. Now has the world gone crazy? Pretty much. But remember there's a fine line between insanity and brilliance. 